not too bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, bet. We have another No Money Spent episode for you guys today. This will be all about the new event, which is called This Isn't Moonshot. Let's go over the new rewards. Let's go over the lines you guys want to be using and a special player, especially you guys have them, that you want to have in your lineup. Let's go over some gameplay, see what plays. Hopefully some good stuff. Let's get right into it. Okay, so here we are at the main screen. Again, it's called This Isn't Moonshot. It ends on May 20th, so we have about three days to complete this. Uh, let's go over the rules first here. Let's go back event info. So here are the rules. Like I said, you can use any players. We have a minimum overall of 60. You have a max overall of 99. And you have a max team overall of 92. So you can't technically have your best God Squad out there uh, as long as you have a lot of the players. One different thing from past events. I think I'm pretty sure this is the first event on Hall of Fame. It will be three innings as well. So Hall of Fame, three innings. And I promise you guys, you will see a lot of Randy Johnson if somebody has him. So let's go over the reward path as well. We have our Juan Marichal all-star card at 92 overall at 8 wins. He has a slider, a four-seam, a screwball, a curveball, and a changeup. So kind of a, you know, kind of a random pitch selection here. Uh, he does have a lot of stamina. He has some decent hits per nine at 89. The one thing with him is that he doesn't throw very hard, and he has a really, really weird windup that takes quite a while. Uh, the pitch control is pretty good, though. I mean, that's some that's some pretty nice pitch control. The break could be a little bit better, um, but other than that, pretty decent card here with Juan Marichal, just to add him to the collection for our all-star. And then we have a postseason Dante Bichette. His fielding is going to suck, but his hitting is going to be very good. He's got 105 contact versus righties, 102 contact versus lefties, 83 power versus righties, and 115 power versus lefties. This could be a really, really nice bench bat, especially against lefties, 102, 115. Very good. Again, the fielding is not very good. The speed is decent. Probably not somebody you'd want to have in your outfield, but if he is the best option you have, definitely throw him out there. And as you guys have noticed, there's been a ton of these Rewind event packs. Uh, we have three of them this time in this event, all the way up to 30 wins, so make sure you guys are getting those. We want to get these cards for the collection, so make sure we are playing at least up until probably 20, but I mean, if you guys have the chance, I'll probably put up 30. Again, it's on Hall of Fame, so just keep that in mind as we're rocking through this. Okay, let's go over how I'm going to set up my lineup and what you guys can do as well. Like I said, if you have Randy Johnson, you can literally throw him every single game if you want to. All you have to do is play a game, forfeit, and just keep doing that. If you guys want to do that, you can. You definitely don't have to. But um, Randy Johnson is going to be the only starting pitcher I'm going to use. All the other guys are going to be commons because I'm trying to lower down that overall for our team. And then for our bullpen, everybody is going to be the best bullpen that we can put in here. We've got Chapman, Devin Williams, Emmanuel Classe, Steve Shishek, Andrew Miller, Josh Hader, Zach Britton, and Kenley Jansen. And then for our lineup, we're going to be rocking Chase Utley, Cattell Marte, Carlos Delgado, Mike Trout, Joe Maurer, Ronald Cunha Jr., Eddie Matthews, and Roberto Clemente. And on my bench, I only have two guys I'm going to be using off my bench. Harmon Killebrew and Jock Peterson. Try to bring down the overall as much as I can with some of these cards. And then we have obviously have just comments that have some good speed that we can use out there. So this is the lineup we're going to be rocking with. Let's play some event games. Let's see how this plays on Hall of Fame. So like I said, we're going to be using Randy Johnson as much as we can in this event. We have a beautiful lineup here as well. We got Shohei going against us for the home team. Let's see what we can do. There we go. Randy Johnson with the first strikeout. Probably first of many in this uh, event. There we go. Strikeout number two for Randy. All right. So we should be able to catch that. Roberto to Roberto. Let's get some hits here. This is me going to try to do the, uh, the quit on me here. This is definitely going to be one of those where they're going to try to offer me the friendly quit with like zero time left. Let's see. Let's see if my prediction is correct here. Comment down below if you think I'm correct. They're going to try to offer me the friendly quit before the, uh, the time lapses up here. Wow, they actually didn't. They didn't offer me the friendly. I guess we'll take our W right there. What a game, man. What a game. All right, we have Randy Johnson going here again. We got, we're going against Logan Webb. Let's see if we actually get to hit this time. Oh, Chase Utley with the leadoff single. I probably should start taking out my P5 guys. There's really no reason having the alliance right now, but I love Chase Utley so much, so. All right, Cattell, that a boy. 
Should at least get a double right there. We might score one here, too. Oh, we're going. 77 speed. Chase Utley. He's there. Let's go. What a start so far. You guys, down below, let me know your guys' thoughts on how the events have gone so far for you guys. Let me know if you guys like the type of events where they're really quick. They're, you know, it seems like they're coming through within three to four days. We have a new event. Let me know down below what you guys think about that. And uh, if we if we want to keep this moving forward within uh, the, the year and, and, and whatnot. Perfect. Oh, Carlos Delgado with the perfect, perfect right there. We're three for three so far. Oh, good pitch, man. Can you please go home while they're trying to... Okay. Why? What? Bro, what is... What is going on? Why are my players... <sighs> nice. Randy with another strike. I'm telling you guys, if you have Randy Johnson... Oh. Literally, you can just spam every single game. I know it's kind of lame, but if you're trying to get him at least parallel five or whatnot, man, he can dominate every single game for you guys. There we go. Ray and Josh with another strikeout. There we go. We got our third out. Let's go hit again. Let's not have a triple play this time, hopefully. Oh, get going. Get going. Get going, please. Well, that went nowhere. I was a little bit early on that one. Please don't catch that one. Let's go. Eddie Matt, dude. I'm telling you guys, Eddie Matthews, I've sucked for years with Eddie Matthews. For some reason this year, I don't know if there's a re revelation or what. I've been nasty with him. It's been awesome. Ew, that was a disgusting swing right there. That was terrible. What a pitch that a boy. Randy with another strikeout. Let's get our last out here. There we go. Nice job. Let's go hit. Oh, Jock. Good swing right there. So I have a bunch of commons on our bench right here just to run. This is perfect. Oh, Chase Utley. That's got to go, right? It's got to go. All right. Not a home run. 86 speed. We'll keep him at second base right there. Let's go. We'll take that. Oh, Carlos. We got to go home. 77 speed. We're there. We're there. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Carlos Delgado. We love it. And a boy. Mikey? Oh, I ball was smashed too. Eh, dang it, man. We had some pretty good PCIs there, man. Some pretty good PCIs. There we go. Look at Chapman just throwing BBs. Go get over there. We've got two down. Let's get one more here. Oh, goodness. The fact that was almost a home run. Sheesh, we get our third win in the event right there. We are 3-0. and I think we get a pack with that. So let's go ahead and go open it up really quick. Hopefully, we get something kind of spicy in this pack. Randy Johnson, again, four strikeouts. I'm telling you guys, he's going to be good. He's going to be very good. Actually, I don't think we got a pack right there. Oh, P4 Randy Johnson. We love it. That a boy. Okay, it looks like we actually don't have. So three at three, you get you get five hundred subs. What it is? I think we might have this pack right here. See if we get a little pack up to end the uh, to end the video. Okay, we got one. Let's see. Give us a diamond here. A nice little gold. We'll take that, Jaden Martinez. Okay. Okay, we'll take that but there you guys have it this is kind of what you guys can expect from this gameplay here um event will be on hall of fame it's going to be a little sweaty especially if you're going to be facing randy johnson which i assume you guys will probably see a lot especially the guys that have them they'll probably keep backing out kind of what i just did right there so make sure you guys are ready for that maybe get some bp against randy johnson with the sliders turned up just so you guys can be ready for it but if you guys enjoyed hopefully it gives you a little insight on what you guys have been doing as well i appreciate you guys watching and i'll see you guys next time peace